Hey guys, this is Maria again with Dancing Girl Lips and today I'm going to teach you how to do a wing on a deep set and round eyes. Apparently it is really really hard so there's a special technique to that. Ready? Let's start. First of all, I will prime the eye or bring the eye forward using Senegens Sandstone Pearl Shadow Sets. I use Senegens all the time, I love it. It has Cineplex Complex in it and they are cream to powder, which means they will not run or have a fall down and they will not crease. I love shadows, they're only $22. Message me if you want some, but I really, really, really love Shadow Sense by Senegens. Now, I will create a little bit of a higher crease than my own and take it naturally through the whole lid. When you have deep set eyes, you don't want to take dark color onto the lid because it will make it look even deeper, but a little bit like a transition color or a really natural color will look just perfect. And I'm taking it slightly down under again for that nice and natural look. Pretty easy so far, right? By the way, this color that I'm using is Mocha Java and I have just filled my eyebrows with it as well. So now that my eye is prepped, I'm just gonna put a little bit more color on it so my eyes are evened out. I'm gonna show you a technique for the round or deep set eyes. Okay, so today's liner is gonna be our limited edition blue. It is called Ocean. It's a beautiful liner and it's so easy to work with and once I put it in, put it on, it just stays. I love it. So I'm gonna take the product and actually before, I need to give this a really good shake. Now, I'm gonna take the line all the way from the corner of the eye and all the way to the edge of the eye. And um, I'm gonna show you what's going to happen. Okay, done. Now, as usually, I would find where my crease would end and on our deep set eyes it is going quite low so i never want to go over it i want to go towards it and slightly below there you go so there is my line i can take it as far out as i want Now, if I leave it like that, and if I look straight forward, it looks quite harsh. See, if I look forward, so what I'm going to do is create like a little bump up on top of it. So I'm gonna go in and a sharp down. in and the sharp down like a Batman wing okay I'm gonna extend this one just a little bit more so you can see see I'm not doing this super accurately so you guys can see what I'm doing But when I open my eye, you cannot really see that up and down bump. You just see a nice, smooth line. All right? And then I can do the same thing kind of on the bottom. Just take the color under and blend it in. Halfway. I'm not touching those two. I'm just blending it halfway. There you go. See? Instead of the line, on the outside I do have it. But on the top part, I have out and down. And that smoothest down, that edge, it okay, doesn't go in, disappears and up. 
it goes when you look forward it goes right nice and smooth and that's the trick to the deep set um, eyes so go ahead and try it and practice it message me with any questions and again all I used uh, was the two shadows to make it a natural look and a ocean limited edition liner outliners are awesome I love them they will stay on they won't crease and they are waterproof, they're amazing. Thanks so much for watching, till next time.